of scoring. And Watson, this is high. Somebody getting underneath it. This is a Pereira, should be the fieldsman. He takes it. Big wick up for Sri Lanka. Watson, the danger man, he has been dismissed by Mendes. Australia, 71 for one. And Shane Watson's fine innings comes to an end. Caught Pereira, Bowl Mendes, 57. Continues, and this is swung high. And he's caught. Oh, is it out? I think he, he is because he held on to it and went over the line and as he crossed the line he threw the ball in so great piece of cricket but Warner stays he's, he's waiting still this is one of the most amazing catches you'll ever want to see on a cricket field if he manages to, to release the ball before he gets over the line so the real test is going to be in the replay to whether his foot has been grounded before he throws the ball away. Takes the ball well, realises he's going over the boundary, in the air, releases it, that's going to be out. That's an amazing catch. Well, I remember him doing that once in a T20 World Cup game. And Angelo Matthews repeats it again. Tremendous catch. And Warner should be on his way. That was a legal catch. Well done, Angelo Matthews. Great piece of cricket. Warner is now still waiting for the umpires but I think it's pretty conclusive to have the state of mind to recognize that he's got to release the ball but not only to release it but to be able to throw it to another fieldsman who's about 30 meters away brilliant catch for one then also to be able to get rid of the ball so quickly that's the end of David Warner a huge wicket oh he's gone ball by Ajanta Mendes that was the off break and Marsh just couldn't read it Sri Lanka get another wicket Australia 73 for 3 Sri Lanka back on rail Sean Marsh stopped by Sangakara of Ajanta Mendes for not and Mendes back in the attack and he's got a wicket first ball Smith looking to go over the offside, looking to clear extra cover. And Mendes has taken four wickets now. Four for eight. Jantha Mendes has broken the back of this Australian top order. Smith goes for 12. And Australia now 113 for five. So this is the wicket. Smith giving himself room, looking to hit it through the offside. Ball not really even turning, just going straight on, skidding on, and Smith playing over it. He's caused lots of doubts in the Australians' batsmen. They've just not picked him. Get off strike, get wide on strike. Which he doesn't do, first ball, he's beaten. It's gone straight through bat and pad. Mendes has taken five wickets. The first Sri Lankan to take five wickets in T20 cricket, and it's Giantha Mendes. Brilliant piece of bowling. Brad Hatton goes without bothering the scorers. First ball, Australia now 113 for six. Top stop, top stop. That was the googly. Just a slight bit of turn, just enough. It's been amazing stuff. But Jantha Mendes has not been in favour with the two selectors. Hardly played in England. Didn't play on Saturday. And the batsman the chance to come back for the second. And that's out. Mendes has got another wicket. He has taken six wickets. Mitchell Johnson's been bowled. Mendes is the first bowler to take six wickets in 2020 cricket. What an outstanding performance he has done for Sri Lanka here this evening. Mitchell Johnson gone for seven. Australia now 129 for seven. He needed a few big blows from Mitchell Johnson. But nothing really happening, just sli sliding through, no, no, no real turn. Well, I did mention that I thought that Mitchell Johnson may opt to go for the single. 
and to get Cameron White on strike, there was a four that was picked up off the first ball. He then got a two and then looked for another boundary.